Hello viewers and today I've got another loadout that you can use in Warzone and today I am returning to the Uzi submachine gun from the Modern Warfare series of weapons. What is really interesting about the Uzi is that it did post launch of Modern Warfare actually have some attachments added to its available customization and that comes in the form of the FSS Carbine Pro Barrel as well as an ammo conversion and this combination of attachments are using both of those. These attachments are increasing damage, damage range, vertical recoil control, all sorts of long to medium range effectiveness boosters. And so for the other three attachments for this combination, I really wanted to try and complement those two new attachments and try and make the Uzi into an overall all round primary weapon. But before I break down the attachments for you and show you the gameplay that I've got with this Uzi, I just want to say thank you very much if you have already subscribed to the channel. And if you are new here, then you can consider subscribing if you don't want to miss a future upload. I'm definitely hard at work making those Vanguard videos right now. Obviously, I've got to get all of those weapons leveled up ready for the Warzone integration into Vanguard. And so if you do want to see all of that, then make sure that you do subscribe. You can leave a like on this video and turn on notifications notifications so you know exactly when I upload. But now sticking with the Uzi, if you want to use the attachments that I'm going to be using then you can feel free to pause the video here. So starting off in the muzzle attachment slot we are using this absolutely massive monolithic suppressor for the sound suppression, 10% boost to damage range and a 15% boost to bullet velocity. Here is the post-launch FSS Carbine Pro barrel which provides that all-important triage of damage range, bullet velocity and recoil control boosts. With the reduction to vertical recoil with this barrel we still want to tighten up the horizontal bounce and we're doing that with the commando foregrip which will provide a 16% improvement to the horizontal bounce of fully automatic fire. And here is the ammo conversion, it definitely increases the damage and of course the damage range. The recoil isn't actually that much higher I don't think. I don't think it's any higher at all to be honest. I think the only downside is of course the 32 rounds compared to the potential 50 that you can get from the standard ammunition. And for the final attachment we don't want to forget that this is at its core a submachine gun and so the aim down sight time is very important for snapping onto the enemy and getting up a first couple of shots compared to users with let's say an LMG who might be a little bit slower on the draw. But anyway this stock will improve the aim down sight time by 13 milliseconds. But let me know down in the comments if you do give this weapon a go you will have to unlock the ammunition conversion and the barrel attachment as well you can do that in modern warfare multiplayer or if you are feeling especially confident you can try and do it in warzone as well but anyway let me know if you give it a go nonetheless and leave a like if you enjoy the video and subscribe if you'd like to see more thank you very much for watching and enjoy the gameplay Enemy UAV overhead. Enemy UAV overhead. I don't think so.
got you. Bloody hell, that was a pain. I've been smashed the glass, headbutted my bloody window frame. An enemy team is hunting you. Stay alert. Enemy UAV overhead. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. Objective is to eliminate the bounty target. Very easily shot me then. Enemy UAV overhead. Still standing. Enemy UAV on Still standing. Ah, oh, same guy. You got a heartbeat too. Another. I'm gonna dead silence all the way around. But they're not in here because it's unlooted. Contract file. We pushing him? He's a. Uh... Oh no, he's not. He's flanking left. He's behind a rock now. He's not moving. I oh, know he's he, he has he's tracking enemy he's there now. Yeah, he's pretty. He might be leading us to his team. Train cart now. Yeah, he is in the train cart. Tracking yeah. enemy. Keep his attention. Or, or just kill him. Well done. Adam. Now he's flying. He's fl he, there. He's look. Setting rally point. Got contact. Gone now. He's either run off or got or picked up ghost, and his loadout was down there. Oh, I've got him back, 50 meters up here. 
Hostile enemy! Ah, threat down! Enemy UAV overhead! I don't know how he did that. That's not me. No, I don't have a sniper. That was actually further down where we took into the circle. I'm pretty... The enemy's in the area. I'm trying to try and get the high ground on him. Oh, I see. I see. Losing ground. I They're not looking our way. I think they've just yeah, pushed the they've, they've downed someone, I think. Yeah, they're still on this hill, there's two of them. One's looking towards you. Requesting area recon. I'm UAVing so he, do, so he doesn't UAV push me. Right just gone into police. Oh no, he's on top of police. Ah. On the AC. Sustaining fire. Strike inbound. I can't hit him. Be advised, friendly precision airstrike inbound. Be advised, UAV is being opened. I'll give you a reason. Is this guy still down here? Yeah, he's just, he was flying, he's just landed on that heli and. Moving! Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've left him. Poor guy. And there's a guy in the yellow house. Yeah, there is. Oh, I'm getting sniped from Hostile somewhere. Dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Guy dropping in on me. Yellow. <laughs> I'm getting looked at from behind. High alerted. There's a guy in the garage. The screen in the garage. Looked at on the right. My high alert is pinging off in a lot of directions. Yeah, there's someone up the hill. He's not shooting. And there's a scream in the My garage. Tracking enemy. Oh, yeah, I'm coming. I, I'm just trying to keep moving. Uh, two on the outer wall. I've only got a bloody pistol. He's on my left. <coughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure I'm dead. <coughs> I, think, I think I'm dead. <coughs>